Michael Vick's legacy should have gotten him into Virginia Tech's Hall of Fame sooner. 19 years ago, a young man named Michael Vick from Newport News, Virginia committed to play quarterback at Virginia Tech. In September, Virginia Tech will be honoring this now grown man as they induct him into their Hall of Fame. It has been 17 years since Vick stepped onto the field at Lane Stadium, but the effects of his presence is still being felt throughout the program. An introduction into the Hall of Fame for this athlete should have happened much sooner, and here is why. The college game had not seen a player like Vic in some time, especially at the quarterback position. In this year, with Virginia Tech, Vic rushed for a thick under 700 yards and did 9 touchdowns. Over the course of his two years playing at Virginia Tech, Vic totaled over 3,000 yards passing, over 1,000 yards rushing, and 21 passing touchdowns, and 17 rushing touchdowns. Vic had a career record of 22 at Virginia Tech and led the Hokies to two straight bowl appearances. Virginia Tech wasn't necessary on the map before Vic committed there. In Virginia Tech's 95 years of existence before Vic decided to join the Hokies, they competed in just 11 bowl games, winning only three. To take a more detailed look, Virginia Tech had just two 10-win seasons in that span. Vic was able to add two more for the record books. Vic's play did more for Virginia Tech than just getting the university wins. His persona and impact on the school as a whole has been felt even after he left for the NFL in 2001. The Hoagies have had much better recruiting classes post Vic. They have also been able to move to a better conference in the ACC. The chance of conferences has brought in more revenue for the school. Virginia Tech has made it to 16 straight bowl games since Vic, the longest streak in school history. To top it off, before he made his way to Blacksburg, Tech had won just five conference championships. With Vic and post Vic, the Hoagies have won a combined five championships in 18 years. Before Vic stepped on the field, the Hoagies had four players selected in the first round of the NFL Draft. Since Vic left, Tech has had five players drafted in the first round. You're listening to Fox Sports 1340 AM.